Well, this man went out for a walk in his Tustin neighborhood but never made it back. Police say he was stabbed and left for dead in the street. Now, detectives are searching for a motive and a killer. And tonight, the murderer has neighbors on edge. KCAL 9 Orange County reporter Stacey Butler is live tonight in Tustin. Stacey, what are neighbors saying tonight? Well, Susie, this has been really unsettling for neighbors. One woman told me that yesterday she was right here. She waved good morning to the victim. And today she saw detectives here and didn't understand why. Well, now we know they're actively trying to figure out who would kill this guy and why. I'm very, very shocked. One night after this well-liked civil engineer was found stabbed to death on a busy street several blocks from his test and condo. Neighbors are trying to understand who would murder 62 year old David Nakaki. Think he was targeted? I don't think so. He just, well, he just kept to himself. I don't, I don't see why somebody would target him. As detectives try to find the killer, neighbors say they can't believe the engineer was found in the road along the popular walk from their house to Prospect Avenue they call the loop. Frequently, we walk around here, but I've never seen anything like that. I'm very shocked and I'm actually scared because I walk there almost every night that way too. So I'm very, very, very surprised. And I'm so sad. I mean, poor him. He's, you know, they're very quiet people. Neighbors are talking about Nakaki's girlfriend, they say, was often in his condo. Just before 9 o'clock last night, a good Samaritan in this white sedan called 911 when he noticed Nakaki face down in the road. The way residents describe their neighborhood quiet, you know, lots of, lots of families, you know, just people take care of each other. They say this is the last street they ever dreamed they'd see police investigating a murder. Detectives say the suspect is still out there. That part's kind of a little bit frightening. Scary. I got to be on the lookout. So, of course, the two big questions, was this just a crime of opportunity or was he indeed targeted? And that's a question that detectives need your help with. If you have any information, you are urged to contact the Tustin Police Department. Back to you guys. A sexual